Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. In this video we will be making this sky airplane nail set and if you are curious on how I made it then keep on watching. I am starting off with applying the press on nails to my fingers. When they are all stuck to my fingers, I like to go back and apply some extra pressure to all of the nails to make sure they adhere better. I will be starting off with creating this little mixture of a milky white gel polish and a jelly blue polish. And next I am going to try to create a ombre effect with the milky white color on the bottom of the nail and the blue mixture on the top. This is actually my first time trying to do an ombre effect so I am pretty pleased with how it turned out. After the polish on the paint is fully cured, I am moving on to my other fingers. We are going to start off with just one coat of the blue mixture on all of the nails. When the first coat is cured, we are going to apply a second coat. But I'm going to add some extra smudges on a few places. This will create a little bit of extra depth when I am going to uh, paint the clouds over them. After that layer is cured, I am going in with the milky white polish and I am going to create some smudges on top of the blue spots we just created. I do not have a technique for this, I am just dabbing the white milky color on top of the blue spots and we will see how it goes. Next I'm using a fine liner brush to apply some regular white gel polish on top of the uh, white smudges we just added to the nail. This will give just a little bit more of a dimension to the nail.
When the clouds are done, I am using a gel tip adhesive to um, glue the airplane charms on top of the nails. It's finally time to decorate the thumb. I am first putting on a layer of the uh, gel tip adhesive so I can glue on these um, golden little small balls. I don't really know how what they're called. I am going to use the small balls to create a cloud shape and it actually took me a whole lot longer than I expected. So make sure you take your time and don't get stressed out, just take it one small ball at a time I guess. Once I finally got it to look how I wanted, I cured it and I applied a non-wipe top coat on top. But before curing the top coat, I am going to sprinkle over some pixie dust gems. I am just using my finger to move the pixie dust into the cloud shape and adjust how they are lying in there. This is the moment where I decide that the thumb is still looking a little bit plain and I want to add another airplane charm. So I will be using the same gel tip adhesive as before to apply the airplane charm on top of the cloud. So when the final airplane charm is on there, I am going in with the non-wipe top coat and apply it over all the nails.
and this is the final look. If you enjoyed watching this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to get notified when I upload a new video. Thank you for watching and I'll see you again next time. Bye bye!